Hello everybody, welcome back to a risky can game. My name is Munch and today we're gonna to be playing some more Minecraft now. I'm more creative to begin with. Her ice bond right down there with a with a ravine that goes right to I eleven, so if anyone wants to copy this one, now I know why because some people like to copy it because there could be diamonds right here. But I think let me just see if there's any one of these corners that you could dig to. But there could be diamond this is that diamond level, so there's nothing down that way. But there could be diamonds here somewhere. There's valuable stuff just waiting to be found. Uh, can't see any diamonds. It doesn't mean they're not there. Are the redstone hiding the secret? Nope. There's lots of coal and iron there though, so you can almost get kid out for iron armor straight away. Redstone hides in the secret. They always say follow the trail of redstone and you'll succeed but I don't know why because I followed the trail of redstone every single time. Okay, so there's nothing down there. Unless you want to go straight to bedrock, which I don't recommend you do. If I find any diamonds in this world, I'd I'll just quickly send you to record and that's in the video. I'll keep my eye out. Okay? Keep my eye out. But anyway, let's fly up. Out of the cave. Now is the you're right by an ocean. Is there a temple or anything in it? I saw some glowy blocks down there. There it is. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, there is some underwater ruins for you to explore. Where's the treasure chest? Where's the treasure chest? There it is. There's another treasure chest. Is this... Is this like two of them on top of each other? That's weird. And the treasure is just back on the island down there. And... I'll see right next to you. Right here. They always say your coordinates are 99. Nine. I don't know how it goes, but I'm like lined up at 99. Nine. And it seems for like here. Okay, like it's only the cords. I like here. See? Nailed it. Oh, that's wait a minute. A book and queer.
We don't need any of that stuff, Doctor. Yeah, you're also right next to this. We have an abandoned village, just to warn you, there are some zombie villagers in there. Is there anything down here in these broken chunks? No. Oh, I can send you the cords to the abandoned village. So we the so I'm right in the middle. Where's the direct middle of this village? It's in the direct middle because there's a village bell. Watch out for these guys because they will attack. They will attack. Okay. Billy's bow is at minus two eight five. Uh, so that was your X and now your Z is fifty five, okay? If you want this world, if if you want not see I can't get my words out today. If you uh, want those Wow. Ooh. And there's also a village right here too. I can send you the cords here too. And it's right next to this one. And this one is not abandoned. The iron golem always hangs out near the village bell. See? And this one is at 60 years. Your X is at 69 and your Z is at 214 and the seed is at and this is the seed 429 796 477 so yes, you can play on this world too if you're bed if you if you have bedrock edition. And this village even has a blacksmith, so that's a plus to it. This time I had nothing, but it could have like four diamonds in there for you. Okay, so the purpose of this video wasn't because the fun wasn't to find this. It's because I'm I know I'm on creative, and some people say it is cheating. But I'm gonna turn it to pure survival in a minute once we build like a base. That's it, a base and some armor. Now I know that is cheating, but I just like being on creative and doing all this stuff. So actually I think we could just replace that line. Let's get some grass. Okay, so uh, we can build our place here. Okay. Now we need to get rid of this actual grass. So we can't have grass in our base, can we? Okay, so let's get this. I'm thinking of like a castle with like stone brick. And I did have to mention my auntie on one of our worlds, she also did this castle. And it looked really nice, so I'm just gonna check it out and see how it is, you know? Mm. 
Where are those walls at? Oh, uh, yeah. Right there. And it's your bed. My favourite colour is lime green, so why don't you get a lime green bed? Chickens are so weak that I can, like, two tap them with my fist. B dubs time. Wait. Okay. Uh, so. We got to bed the first time, but now let's be dubs. Don't go to sleep yet. And then the others, this is a big seven on hermit craft. And then the others said, be dubs, you don't have to go to sleep yet and keep breaking this bed. And then, he, and then he keeps placing again and he said, but we have to. It's very funny. If you want, you can t go and check out Hermit Craft server too. All those people need a few more subscribers and I think you might do it. And there is a chance that B-Dubs might even be watching this video. Uh, or other members of the Hermit Craft server. It's a very fun and funny server. Shall I, shall I tell you who the best is on now? He's, he's known as Pesky Bard. I think you know who it, who you are if you're watching. Green, come right up. Well, if you can. Well, I mean you can, but you know what I mean. He is the peskiest and the funniest on on the Hermitcraft server. And good times for Scar, this is true. He always explodes himself. He always flies into a wall. Or flies into a, a ravine by accident. He's the clumsy one. You can still see that village off in the distance. And the blacksmith, which is really rubbish, but like I said, you might, the max diamonds I think that you can get in these, there's two of them. Ooh, a big plus, there's two blacksmiths. So, this, see, now this one's a bit better. And, hey. And you can get these guys, which will sell you very good weapons. Now, where's the other one? Ooh. There's also a very good armor that will sell you armor, which is also very good. Hey, look, and this is a ho village hotel, we call it. So, basically, the vi- So, uh... This one looks like, yeah, this one's the armourer's home. So the armourer's, to get to his job, he needs a blast furnace. Now, and that's one of the best, actually that is the best villager. And also the, one of the best is these ones. Now, now these are the blacksmiths and they need a grindstone. They don't need a lot of expensive items, but... And you might want to trade, get some animals and start trading with them because they are very good. And they give you some very good items, like the blacksmith. When you get him to like max level, he can trade you like diamond sharpness, like I think the max is sharpness. Five, which is the max level of sharpness too. Sharpness five, diamond swords. And now the updates come, and they might update villagers to trade sharpness five, never white sword. We never know. But it's never white, it's the new strongest item. It's not diamonds anymore. And the armors can get you like protection for diamond armor. Now, again, when the up when a villager update might come, 
day. My trade protection uh, by protection for Neverite armor. Now my mom's here again. That's why you can hear lots of noise if you can. Okay. So I have to uh, go in a minute. So let's just finish this last wall. I didn't work out. <laughs> that's better. That's how fast I want it to go. Almost done now. Now I guess this is like another tutorial on how to be, build a castle. Now I'm afraid the chicken sucks so just gonna create little holes that the chicken can escape out of. Come on, little holes. I know you want to go and get out into the open. Do ya? There we go. Fill in the holes. Chicken tree now. I don't want to just kill it like he did with his brother. Hey. To make you feel bad, bro. Get back in there. To make you feel bad, I killed your brother. Which, I know it does not sound good, but. Chicken, get back in there. Okay. I'm sorry for what I'm doing, but. <coughs> It has to be done. Shouldn't should have came back in, shouldn't ya? Alright, so uh, I have to go and eat now. Thank you all for watching. My name is Munch and that is me out. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. Bye bye.